Today, I turned into an alien, and my neighbor now owns a farm where he captures my friends. This is going to be so weird. What's up, dude? How's it going today? Jack Blake here, and today we're going back on Mobile Monday to Hello Neighbor Knockoff Games on the Android Play Store. I am having a great time. I just came back from VidCon. We're gonna have a great day today. We're gonna have some real fun. Not fake fun. We're not gonna have some fake fun, you know, where we're just pretending. We're gonna go and find some stuff because these things are so crazy. Seriously, we're in the, uh, uh, what is it, Android Play Store, like I said. You look up Hello Neighbor and you just get nonsense. I'm serious. You go and you look and I mean you just get like crazy games and I'm gonna find some crazy games here today okay now I'm so excited for all of these games okay wait wait what is this grandpa alien escape game that has nothing to do with hello neighbor why is it here grandpa alien escape game it says rescue trapped alien friends okay well we got our alien buddies it says let's plan the escape from evil grandpa's farm <laughs> wait is this your like alien grandpa I mean, looking forward, I mean, this thing is just packed. I mean, we got dudes running. We have execute an exciting escape plan. I mean, Jimmy over here is already leaving the solar system. Hi, guys. I'm out of here. I mean, this thing just looks intense. I mean, this alien ship doesn't even have anybody. Like, it's not even sucking up anything. It's just kind of like putting a light show over there. I mean, they're having a great time. I mean, this looks like an incredible game so far. I mean, I do like the fact that it's also on a barn. I mean, we got kind of like this... This, uh, you know, concept of, like, real aliens, if they came to Earth, what would happen? In this sense, why is there a Santa Claus alien? <laughs> what? There's characters. This is so bad. You buy alien characters? And you just run around the farm. Oh my gosh. And wait a minute. Is it, does it look like this? It does it not look 3D? Guys, I'm excited to play these. These are so broken, and we're finding some cool ones. I mean, so far, we already got a good one on the agenda. Let's find some more. Oh boy, oh boy, we're just searching for some more. Are you ready for some, like, really crazy one? It's gonna have some weird grammar or something, and it's just gonna be straight out of nowhere, probably. They have Patrick Neighbor. We played SpongeBob, and we played Squidward. They have Patrick Neighbor now. Oh my gosh, meet the sponge's friend, Patrick. Reveal the secrets of your neighbor. Seven languages, one spar. Hey, um, I'm Patrick. Uh, y yes, uh, hey, hey, Patrick, uh, nice to meet you. What, what is this? <laughs> what, why is this in the, the top right? I just noticed it right now. Uh, what are we, uh, are we just gonna explode? What? So, um, <laughs> the game already looks insanely cool. Um, we just have the weirdest looking dude who looks nothing like Patrick. He's like orange. Like, Patrick is supposed to be pink. Why is there just a bag of money? What is he offering us? He's just like bringing a, or this is like a suitcase of money. Man, this game is pretty weird, but it looks cool. And every single picture just brings us a new scenario. I mean, we're dealing with gold bars, pliers. I mean, there are seven languages. I mean, what? You know, Patrick is just learning his languages here. We are looking and we just found another crazy one called Neighbor Prank Game. 3D Horror Escape Games. Is it, is it multiple games? Are we downloading one game that's just many games or is it a game? It says scare neighbors with spooky tricks and escape the house in Neighbor Prank Game. Okay, it sounds like simple enough, but I mean... This looks so weird. It looks like somebody just showed up to a random house and they're like just standing over there by the gate. I mean, why are they just standing there at the gate? Why would we break into a creepy house for no reason? And especially like a creepy looking mansion in the dark. Why not do it in a daytime scenario? Why? All right, so we got our three games here today. Aren't you feeling it? Aren't you feeling it? Feel it in your shoulders? Feel like a warmness in your shoulders? You're ready to go? Maybe that's just the heat. The sun, I don't know, it's like summer. Maybe you're just feeling a little warm. Turn on a fan, because right now it's gonna be cool, because we're going back into the games. Um, let's see, what should we start with? I mean, we have Grandpa Alien Escape Game, we have Patrick Neighbor Sponge Friend, <laughs> we have Neighbor Prank Game. Okay, you know what? I think we should start with this one. I feel like this one's gonna be the weirdest, um, but we can work our way to Patrick Neighbor. So we'll go Prank Game, a Grandpa Alien Game, and then Patrick Neighbor. So, without further ado, let's just jump into the prank game first. 
I don't know what I'm getting myself into. All right, so we're on the main menu. We're ready to go. I mean, we're just staring at a, uh, a mansion, a creepy mansion. I mean, I don't know where we're pranking this dude. Are we showing up to like a cemetery? A, cemet a cemetery? A cemetery. I can't even say cemetery. Are we showing up to a cemetery to just make him like come back to life like what is this why is it so creepy all right so we're starting at the game look, look at, at this dude. dude why does he look so weird oh my gosh that is the creepiest looking dude i've ever seen in my life it looks like he's been crying <laughs> it looks like he's like stop it stop making fun of me yeah already this game is looking great it says mission objective find a place to hide near neighbors near neighbor's main gate um okay i mean I can't look up and down, and I guess this is the only place. We literally are going into a cemetery. I was joking before, but we, we literally are. Okay, well, am I supposed to hide in here? Is that like the easiest thing? I want to walk around and explore. I mean, look at this place. In the cemetery. Okay, secretly watch your neighbors as they arrive. Are all of them showing up? What are they having a meeting? They are. Oh my gosh, they're just showing up. Okay, so my neighbors are literally just walking up to the gates. No, they're they're just opening the gates. Wait, wait, what happens if I walk out? Oh, I can't. It doesn't even let me interrupt them. What? Oh my gosh. So if I hid over there, how was I supposed to see this? I, I guess we picked the right spot, right? Um, uh, all right. So I, I guess that's... That's it. Find a way to, to enter the neighbor's house. This is the neighbor's house? Where am I living? If I'm the neighbor, where am I? Where's my house? Is this my house? You know, like <laughs> the little side room over here? Okay. Um, yeah, that's great. I'm just so like, I live so minimally. Oh, okay, so I guess we're going into the tunnels of this thing. I think we might have to- Yes, we have to solve puzzles! We have to- Wait! Oh, this opens. Um, how would I have known this? Oh, okay. And they just open- They just open up! That's so convenient. Yeah, my name is Jeremiah. I'm a cool rat. I walk down in the sewers. I mean, look at me. I'm going around opening up gates. I got real hands. I'm a- I'm a rat! <laughs> with real hands. I mean, I, I don't know if there's a rat out there with fake hands. Oh my gosh What is this? It's it's just walking towards us. Okay. Hey, buddy. I'm like you. I'm I'm Jeremiah the rat with real hands <laughs> Okay, what are we doing now? Oh, okay, so I guess we're just stalking our neighbors more uh, Accomplished objective accomplished in three seconds. Okay, so if I wait here for three seconds, I win? Okay, cleared. I I'm posing again. I guess we'll just go on to the next level. Uh, so we're on the next level. Why did my voice get l so low? All of the sudden, I turned into a man. Hello, there is a gift box over... over car. <laughs> there is a gift box over car. Pick it up. All right, well, thanks. I don't know who's telling me all of this stuff. I can't look down, Mr. Man. I can't pick it up. How do I pick it up if I can't look down? It won't let- it won't let me look down if I look- maybe if I look down at an angle? Okay, we got the present that they apparently left on the hood of their car. I don't know why they would leave that. Okay, so it says get inside the room and place it there to surprise Miss Drago. Such a weird name. And where does there? I don't even know where I'm supposed to be going. Hello, does anybody know how to work this place? I, oh, hey, this is, might be it. Hey, buddies, um, I'm here to give you a present that you got yourself, and I'm just going to leave it inside for you. Just being the kind Samaritan that I am, I'm gonna take your present that you brought, or bought at least, and um, I'm just gonna give it back to you. Hey, Mr. Miss Drago, we have a present for you. Okay, so if I file the taxes, I mean, maybe I can come through with like a 401k investment. If hey, hey, are, are you just ignoring me? I, just, I have a present here. Do you not want it? I only have like 35 more seconds to give her the present before it like it, it explodes. I forgot. All right, so here we go. We lay it down and ta-da, there, there's your present. Now what do I do? Now get outside and find a place to hide. 
Uh, all right, I guess this is still so weird. There's like the same tree like every <laughs> Every place the same tree. It's like they took the tree cloned it. Oh wait I have I need to hide I have eight seconds. I'm literally gonna fail because I decided to talk about trees Four, three, two, one. failed <laughs> I failed all right, so I redid it. I obviously have a lot more time and uh, they have the little camera like they do in a lot of the other games like the teacher one um, I'm supposed to be hiding here, but it seems like oh wait. She just got her present. I'm like over here right now um, What is she doing get away? I died in here This is my property from the dead. Okay, so I gave her a present. That was pretty much a uh, a threat Okay, and now she's do she's like Dancing. She's dancing. She's crying like this. Oh, oh no! Oh, oh, this is so devastating. <laughs> what is that? Seriously, these games blow my mind. They're just so weird. They're so weird. Oh man. All right. So before we get you know too into that game and just start dancing around in different little you know moves, we're just like crying like this, <laughs> or maybe dancing. We're like oh. And I'm dancing and I'm crying at the same time. All right, so let's go to this game grandpa alien escape game um, It looks like it's gonna be good. The guy's giving me a thumbs up. He's ready to go. Let's jump on in All right, so we've jumped into the game. Oh, this is that meme, right? Where there's like a dancing alien. I don't even know the song, but it's like some dancing meme, right? Oh Man, this is so weird. Oh, okay. Well, now we're just dancing aliens going around. Oh, we have little cutscenes. <laughs> this is uh, great. It says no aliens allowed. They're just hitting the aliens. What is going on? These dudes are like brothers. They're twins. And they're just hitting the alien over and over again. The worst part is like this guy doesn't even know what's going on. He can't even see anything. Uh, brother, uh, no mean to alarm you, but I have no idea where you are. I cannot see a single Why thing. Not stay down. He just keeps cutting back up. Just stay down. This is so weird. It's just going on forever. I mean, does this not blow your mind like in weirdness? I mean, look at the alien. The alien's watching this happen. He's just smiling kind of. He's like, it happens. It, it happens. Look at his face. It says your alien friends are captured by grandpa. Stay away from grandpa. Yeah, I mean, I guess. Whose grandpa is it? I don't know how games keep calling some random old people grandpa. You don't call these people grandpa. You call them just sir. Like some random dude. Your alien friends are captured by some random dude, not grandpa. All right, so I guess we're just doing a basic tutorial right now. And we're just running around. So this is that like alien meme thing. I mean, this is like the weirdest game that I've ever seen in my life. It says, hey, wait, grandpa has captured your friend. Uh, okay, wow, they're just dragging him by his legs. And there's like three of the same dude. And this guy's in like a pirate uniform. He's in a pirate uniform. All right, so we're at our checkpoint and we're dancing. We've just started dancing. There's no way this is real. There's no way that the developers were like, this is a real game. Grandpa's cooking your friend. Help him before it's too late. He's cutting the carrots like in cartoons. And this other dude, he's just sitting in the thing. What? Go to the checkpoint to collect dog toys. Okay. All right, it says now tap on the toys to collect them. Oh, okay. <laughs> now press the button to throw their toys. We're just throwing dog toys now. And now the dogs are perfectly harmless. They don't even look around. The guy's just, he's not even picking up the toy. He's kind of, he walked over it. He didn't even get the toy. He's like, what is he doing? He's like peeing on my toy. No, come over here. What are you doing? All right, so we held the bucket upside down like a smarty pants. And now we're dancing. No, this is so bad. No. Why? Why? I think I'm losing it, guys. Um, <laughs> this game is so weird. I think this is probably one of the weirdest ones I've ever played. And I think they did that intentionally. I feel like they tried to do it. It says, Grandpa is doing archery on your friends. Save them. Why don't they just move? Just move. Why are you guys standing there? Do I have to save my friends from every situation? Find elephants and throw firecrackers at them. Why? Why, why would I do? And why are they running at? Oh, they're just running past me. Um, okay. Oh man, uh, please, I swear if they start dancing right now, if I save them, if I save you guys and you start dancing, 
I will literally lead them back to you. Please do not. I don't. Don't. Oh, wait. We just got- I got bit by a dog and we started dancing! No! Don't do it! No! Stop! Alright, well, that's enough of that one. We have seen a lot of weird stuff. Dude, I, I love playing these games with you guys. You guys should go out and find some weird games like that. And then we'll just play it. I know you guys love all these crazy games. Um, even my little sister, who's like 12, just says that, like, when you find a game that's just so bad, it's sometimes even better. Because when it's bad, it's super funny, and it's more funnier than a game that's trying to be funny, right? I mean, if somebody made a game and they're trying to throw in jokes in there, you're like, huh, lame. But, like, if they're trying to be good and they fail, you're like, ha, ha, ha you're bad. <laughs> All right, we're going to our last game here. Patrick Neighbor Sponge Friend. I don't expect much for this one because I feel like every single one of their games is the same. Actually, this looks a little bit different. Okay, well, maybe we're getting something different here. All right, so the task we have today is find the key and open the main door. Seems pretty simple enough. Um, oh, so this one's way different than uh, the other ones. The other ones were kind of just like um, a house across the street, but this is not Patrick's house at all. He's supposed to be living under a rock. What are the creators of these mods living under a rock and not know what SpongeBob is? Huh? Huh? Get my pun? <laughs> all right, um, he owns a boat. I mean, I've never seen him drive before in his life, but I do remember the episode where he was teaching SpongeBob how to drive and he was kind of good. I mean, so I kind of expect him to have the nicest of boats. Dude, this guy's living so nice. How did I even get in? I mean, it's like we're surrounded right now. What did I just appear here? Was I invited in his house? Hey, dude, Patrick, what's up? I'm here to hang, having a great time. Why'd you lock the door? Dude, hey, Patrick. Patrick, let me in! Patrick, I see you! No, I I'm not here. Patrick, I hear you in the other room! I know that you're here! Uh, no, uh, leave a message after the beep. Beep. Patrick, stop! Okay, seriously, I know you're like right over here. Oh my gosh, why is he just- Just let me in! Let me just hang out with you, dude! Okay, well, I literally have no idea how to get inside of his house. I mean, there's all these little, like, windows that I can jump through, but there's literally, like, no boxes or anything. So I would have no clue. Oh, actually, you know what? It's this back area. This has to be it. All right, buddy, I'm just gonna have to enter in through the back door. I'm walking on through. Dude, his house is so good. Look at this. This is so much better than any of the other mods. Or not mods, a game... Games, I guess. Oh, dude, oh, okay. Well, now he's mad. Where do I go? I have nowhere to go. All right, we're gonna get the key. Okay, I think I got the key. Now, what's weird is that I have to go outside now, walk to the front of the house, and open the door, which literally makes no sense. Like, if I have the key now, like, why do I need to open it up now to get to the next level? I got it. I got the key. Just let me, let me win, please. Uh, hello? Um, housekeeping. I'm here to open your door. Um, wait, why is it not working? No, 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 no. Okay. I just won random. I clicked the button and it took so long. I thought I lost. Pfft. I mean, you know, I'm just the best. I'm the best at all of this. Uh, you know me, Zach Blake. I complete all the tasks. I need to spoil the f fire hydrant. Wait, what did it say? Spoil the fire hydrant. What does that even mean? Does that mean like mess it up? I think they were Google, uh, Google Translate it. Like spoiling, at least to me, is like food or like you spoil your children. You treat them too kindly. You never discipline them. I'm gonna go to the fire hydrant and um, I'm just gonna give it all the candy in the world. I'm going to spoil the fire hydrant. All right, so we got this. We're just gonna walk outside now. I think that's where we need to go. Um, I'm here to spoil your fire hydrant. The one that's just randomly over here next to your house with the giant bushes next to it. Um, we're just gonna go break it, I guess. This isn't this like super illegal because if his house ever catches on fire, um, he pretty much just burns. Okay, so spoil the fire hydrant. Aw, oh, look at it, he's crying. You're such a spoiled fire hydrant. You never listen to me anymore. You're just so spoiled, Mr. Fire Hydrant, thinking you're so cool. All right, so I mean, I've been here for like a couple of minutes now and nothing's going on. Oh, there we go, finally. It was like waiting for me to like yell at it. <laughs> it's like, what's going on? Like, oh, sorry, congratulations, the mission is complete. Complete the following tasks. You need to hack the neighbor's computer. Find the password note, hack the neighbor's computer. This is the same things as like every other game. They don't change the missions. Oh boy. What's crazy is I, I wonder what um, Patrick Neighbor's password would be. Would it be password or would it be like one, two, three? 
Um, I don't know. I'm supposed to be finding his uh, password before I go to the computer. So I don't know if that's somewhere else or not. All right, I'm literally just walking behind him as he goes to places. Um, we're gonna go get his password. We're just walking around his house. It's crazy that we know where everything is. Um, it's like, how would we even know? It's on a mini map. Like the top left just shows you everything. All right, so we got his password. Um, I guess we're not gonna read it yet. Um, but I guess we know his password. Patrick's secret password to his secret computer that I've never be seen before in my life. Actually, you know what? There was one episode with, um, what is it? We have to- <gasps> Whoa! Did he- I would- I looked down, I was scratching my nose! How did he see me? What? It says, game over. You've being catched. You've means you have. You have being catched. Everything is wrong here. It's you've been caught. You've being catched. Why? Why? <laughs> oh man, you know what though? That's funny. You've been catched. <laughs> Somebody should comment that. You've been catched over and over, man. <laughs> if you do comment that down below, um, you should also comment only the people who watch this whole video will know. So then we'll get the, you know, full, Ooh, I'm scared. Okay, we'll get the full people to watch. So we have to go over here and get his password again. Jeez, <laughs> this is hard. All right, I've been doing this for probably five minutes now and I've literally been caught probably like seven or eight times. He, for some reason, is patrolling his house and knows exactly where I am at exactly every single time he walks by. So I'm literally just gonna stand in the corner here um, I'm gonna stay as far away as possible. Um, he's gonna walk to his little password. He's gonna walk back. That's when we're gonna get it. And I, I don't know what even happened the first time. I should have gotten it that time. All right, so he's walking back right now. He should be like right here. There we go. Now we walk on through to here, I think. And we go up here. And hopefully we can get the password without him, um coming up here to get us we're gonna get the password real quick we're gonna walk i guess we're just gonna go straight to the computer i think we can do this hold on hold on hold on hold on oh no 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 why i should have just waited no it's been taking me so long all right, um, this is my final attempt. I mean, he's literally just cheating at this point, so... I mean, I don't know. Patrick, you don't seem like the real Patrick. Um, like... Um, he feels like he's Plankton in disguise. I remember he was asking for the secret Krabby Patty formula earlier, so... I don't know. All right, I've literally been waiting, like, five minutes for him to stop moving. And I think the game's programming just gave up. He has stopped. We are gonna finish this finally, please! Okay. Oh my gosh, that took so long, but I did it. Jeez, never give up on your dreams. You too, one day, can hack Patrick's computer. Oh man. It says, you found information from the computer that your neighbor stole many money from the bank. You need to find that money. Many money. Okay, well, you know what? I feel like this game just tries to rope you in with some fake stuff, but... It's kind of fun. I mean, <laughs> the words and the spelling are so weird, and he looks just so unusual. But it's kind of funny. So I'm gonna leave it there. Hopefully I made you smile. Um, that's all I ever want to do. Um, I'm glad that we actually uh, stuck through and actually hacked the computer. You know, we went on to the, the next level. You know, I did it for you guys, but now we know that he stole many money from the bank. Just all, meant many of those monies. So click the top right if you want me to keep you smiling. Join the DAC Pack by clicking subscribe. The DAC Pack, super strong community growing. Um, I feel like um, we're one of the fastest growing, you know? And we're going on to 600K. So hopefully you like this video. Stay tuned for some more. Make some suggestions. Even, you know, maybe suggest some crazy games that you found on the App Store. Or I mean Android Store because I feel like the App Store is way different than the Android Store. But uh, yeah. Um, I'm looking forward to your comments, and especially that one comment that I told you guys to comment a little bit ago. If you skip through the video, you don't even know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in that next video. Let's keep it going. Thank you guys for watching, and as always, peace out, my dudes.